is your favorite thing about me. Stop. <laughs> like, actually, stop. How does that make... <laughs> right, that's literally subjective. That is no, just... No, not, guys. You have to, I have to think, what does she want us Come to say? Come on. No, the best answer is gonna get the point. So come on. My favorite thing about you is your constant vim, constant okay, yeah, energy, okay. shouting up here okay. all the time. Okay. <laughs> My favorite thing about you is that one time in the year that I've known you, you brought me food, Aww. and it tasted nice. It should have been more though. Mm. I'm not. I don't. I'm, Great. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm not, I'm not trying to buy you. you yeah. and one... See, I, I thought, what did she no, want I'm me to not, say? I'm not pandering to Simran whatever. Simran gave me what I wanted to yeah. hear, so the point goes to Simran. I want to win this. I haven't won a quiz, I don't think, yeah. in the year. I'm not here to lick Lena's boots, so... That's why you're going to lose. You know what? So the next four questions, Simran, she's going to win everything. Right, number two. Which historical figure would I batter? The, uh, uh, Boris Johnson. <laughs> historical figure. Oh. Allegedly, in her opinion. In my opinion. <laughs> and it's historic. That they're, they're, they're already dead, so she can't do this, right? Historic. Um, allegedly. Yeah. Right. Okay. Allegedly. Margaret Thatcher. Margaret Thatcher. Um, I was gonna say it, but I'm gonna go instead for someone like. Um. Ugh. I I would think is Margaret Thatcher was on in my head, but I think there's someone who's done something worse. In in our opinion, um, I think you buy Henry the Eighth because he was um oppressed women and you don't like that. Um, so <laughs> I neither of you guys said the person I thought you was gonna say, and I realized that maybe actually I actually haven't spoken about my like particular disdain for um this person as much. Um, Can you give us a clue? And so see if last can get year it? I I wrote an article for Sludge Mag. Shout out Sludge Mag. Um, called Skeng Van Churchill. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I, knew, I knew, I knew, there was. Oh, <laughs> but, 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 out of both of your answers, Simran's is the most. Uh, si- like, yeah. I mean, obviously, obviously I know you don't want to buy Henry the Eighth. No, but I would I also, I would so... also buy Henry the Eighth. Yeah. I can't lie. Can I just say, why is he so ugly? Why is he so ugly? Like, do you know what? Yeah, you know, I went to uh, Warwick Castle one time, and they have like all of these figures of like old like english royalty and and pol- and and public figures and whatever and even when you see portraits of like old english like royal family why are they all clapped um in her opinion uh, come on that's not offensive <laughs> that's not offensive well, you can't, they can't do us for saying henry the eighth was ugly come on some someone I hope is saying here fuming. Like, how <laughs> no, dare I'm you sure. I'm sure. Anything. I'm sure they would. And, and if you're the type of person who's fuming at that, this show is not the right show for you. I mean, stay on though, because we need the views. But um, yeah, have I never spoken about my like? I have a lot of vim for a lot of people, but I have a I have a very special vim for Churchill. Yeah, no, I understand. Now, now that you said it, I'm like, yeah. It's annoying because literally in my head, I was thinking, oh, who is literally doing really bad things I knew to it was South Asian be people. <laughs> I couldn't I couldn't put my head on it. I was, I said, have I never spoken about it? No, guys? I think we obviously will have discussed it yeah. at some point. Like I'm annoyed I wrote, now. I wrote I literally guys if you want like go just Google Skengman Churchill Sludge Mag and you'll find what I wrote about it. It's actually a historical account of why I hate Churchill, not just you know yeah, not just saying. Not like, just me going reasoning. off at him. Although some of it is me going off at him, yeah. but it's a, it's a historical account of why right. he's so problematic. So it's two now, great. Um, <sighs> right, third question: What keeps me awake at night? Now this is a bit. <laughs> this is a very open. This is a very open question, but this this will really test how much you guys listen to me because there was one particular episode, but then I think I've mentioned it another time as well. I stay awake thinking about. I'll give you a clue. It's something that I love. Like, something yeah, that I love so yeah, much, yeah, it keeps yeah. me awake at night thinking about it. Same when you go first. It's going to be food, like, and curry. Okay, and, like, Carlos? Um, I'm going to censor my answer. So, three, two, one. <laughs> I was going to say... <laughs> oh, sh- oh, damn. <laughs> um, Yo! <laughs> I wish I could tell you what Carlos just said. 
Ah, do you know what? I'm going to give you both a point for that. Simba was actually Yo, the right the answer. Faith, the faith you had in that mute, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because I'm no, going to give right. you... I'm, no, Simba was right. Simba was right. Do you remember when we did the episode with Shreta and I was like, guys, I love yeah, stuff. Yeah. I just literally stay awake at night thinking about how much I love curry. Right. Fourth question. Fourth question. I have faith in the high radio technical. <laughs> Number four, what's my dream career? <laughs> like some kind of sugar baby, but hybrid with like political powerhouse taking down the patriarchy type of job. <laughs> um, I think a what's it called? An academic doctor. Actually, can I change? In can South I change Asian Martha? studies. Okay. Anything that doesn't go by the rules of capitalism. I mean, that's a bit open. Yeah, simmering. but that's my answer. Uh, that was actually a trick question because who the hell dreams of who the hell dreams of labor? See, see, see. <laughs> I knew I it. I don't have a dream for yeah. No, you know what the thing is? The thing is, you were both actually right. So if I had if I had to work, my dream job would be what Carlos said. Like I would be a, a South Asian historian, a professor. Yep. And Simran is also right. Like <laughs> you, I would have no career. Like it, it goes against capitalism. So I would give you both. A point or half a point or whatever. What are we on? So you're Wait, let's, just get, let's just get a point for that. Okay, cool. Like so you're a, on like four. Don't do half on... points because it doesn't make sense yeah, to yeah, do yeah, everyone. Yeah, yeah, so I'm yeah, on yeah. four. You're on four and you're on two. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, final question. I'm, if I'm... I could have one wish, what would it be? All right, Ray J. Uh, 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 <laughs> deport Pretty Patel. In her opinion, <laughs> this is a joke. It obviously doesn't mean yeah, that. Yo, you know what? I'm sorry. Have you guys seen the new the new proposed? Yeah, the bill. And uh, the... Yeah, it's a joke. Yeah. Even me, I'll say it this time. It's a joke. <laughs> yeah. Um, Okay, Carlos. To be, live a happy life and world, world peace. Uh, the right answer was the total destruction of capitalism. <laughs> I mean, if you could argue that that was world peace. <laughs> that's my... That's my... Uh... Fine, you can have half a point. Then. I don't want to do half. Just give me the point. Uh, you know you want nah. to. No, 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 no. Half a point. That's so we've ended that round with Simran uh, four out of on five. four out of five and Carlos on 2.5 out of five. Yeah, but how does it feel to have four points knowing that you've got it through licking... Mm. Great, because <laughs> she knew what she needed mind, to I don't mind, I wanted points. <laughs> exactly, she knew what she needed to say. That in itself is knowing the answer. Okay. Even if Even if her answer wasn't... Even if that's not really what she loves about me, she knew how to answer. So that's because she knew the me. The game is how well do I know her? Exactly. So. Well, I've, I've got morals in it. Anyway. Yeah, and you're a loser. Well done, Simran. <sighs> wow. Okay, next. Hang on. Now, now it's time I'm for Simran's quiz. I'm going to one of my questions real well, actually, quick. Actually, guys, I was going to play the music and then we return to the quiz. Oh. Actually. If you don't mind, I'm feeling very bitter right yes! now. <laughs> so. Come on, it's our birthday today. Cheer up. 